Hey guys, uh, I'm, today I'm just going to review the Apple TV. That I, it's, a, it's a 2011 model. Um, really cool device. Really easy to use. Nice looking. Great little body. I'm pretty sure it's the same look as the previous model, but it, um, it has a A5 chip. It's a single core processor, which is enough. Uh, also, you've got your nice power buttons. So you've got your nice buttons at the back. You've got HDMI. You've got, is it USB 3? Yeah. And then it's got Ethernet and optical audio. But the best thing about this thing is that it just, it, it has its own built-in Wi-Fi and everything. So you can... Um, stream every, any YouTube clip just from your uh, from anywhere as long as you're plugged into a TV obviously and uh, then you can also airplay your your iPad or your i or your uh, MacBook or that sort of stuff from it I like the actual remote that they're using now as well uh, well, actually, I think it's the same as the previous one, but I just love Apple's remote because I'm just comparing it because I used to have a W, a Western Digital TV Live, and it was painful to use. It was like really good features, but just way too many options, and you just wanted to be simple and just work. And it didn't even have built-in Wi-Fi, so that's the reason why I got rid of it and got this instead. But the product looks good. It's compact. I love Apple's packaging, and I love. Um, the way that they put everything together and the simplicity of everything that they use. Uh, so what I'm going to do, I'll actually show you a video of it performing and the 1080p quality video that I can show. One sec. Alright, so I've just plugged it in. Uh, one thing I do love about, I've just plugged it into the power cable and also the HDMI that runs straight to my TV. One thing I love about Apple product is the quality of their... Um, the quality of their cables that they use really really nice quality cables they just feel good uh, they, um, they fit easy they're really snug and just don't find any issues so this is your home screen it's got a really nice layout this is actually a pretty crappy TV but it makes it look really really nice um, that's annoying Right, so here it's got your, you know, your, your TV show options, your movie options, you can scan all the way across, and it's very quick. I mean, it's connected to my Wi-Fi, and it connected really quickly. Um, but I don't know how, how good a picture this is going to bring up, but if you can sort of see how crisp the edges are of, the, of that image, um, it's just the 1080p is brilliant. It works so well. And it makes it honestly makes my TV. If I look, if I watch something in on DVD, it looks shit compared to this. Um, it's got all your app icons, which is similar to your iOS layout. I do like it. Some people don't think it's as good, but I think it's magnificent. Um, your YouTube. Let's have a look. Your YouTube quality is really cool. Like it gives you that little rolling start at the front there. Let's go and open a clip. It's nice and quick. What do we got? Let's do this World War Z stuff. See how fast it loads up? Like, super speedy. The picture quality is great. The sound quality is amazing. And then let's just skip forward a little bit. Gives you that little dial down the bottom that shows you it speeding up. It always stays ahead really quickly. It always stays ahead. Like we stream video 24-7 and we love it. Anyway, I've got the volume really low so you can't really hear what's going on. Um... What else is good about this thing? Anyway, let's just go back. Uh, you just hit the menu a few times, it takes you all the way back home. Uh, what else can I show you with this thing? Photo stream, yeah, that's not too bad. 
actually what I'll do, I'll pause the video and I'm going to let it bring up the, um, the screensaver it does. I'll come back. Mm. So this is this is full HD screensaver that the Apple TV kicks into uh, once you know don't touch it for a while. I've just got it set to random on like the National Geographic, and um, you know as you can tell the colours are really vibrant, and again the the picture quality is just brilliant. Like it's so crisp. So, Chris, anyway, the bit of an animation there that allows it to swing past or some of them scan through on a on different picture frames. So, yeah, really good device. Highly, highly recommend it. Um, I'll see if I can do a bit of a... I want to see uh, if I can do... Oh, I can't while I record. Um, I was going to do an AirPlay thing for you guys because I do a lot of AirPlay through my phone, um, even... Uh, through my iPad and then I do all sorts of stuff um, but yeah really cool device and I think it's one of the best out, out there some people say it hasn't got enough options but uh, let's do this Let's show you a picture quality of, of a movie. Now this is streaming straight from my iTunes. Streaming through Wi-Fi straight from my iTunes. Let's just fast forward a little bit. I got this guy Tony. He said he can get your construction done. All you need is call me. Let's see more exciting part. Let's do something like that. Ladies and gentlemen. Please prepare to bear witness to the making of history. Start transmission. Anyway, that gives you a fair idea as to what what it sounds like and what it looks like and everything. Uh, if you like the video, let me know. If you're looking at getting a, um, you know, doing getting something for your TV, then definitely, um, definitely get the Apple TV. It's, it's a great product.